understand uh, epilepsy or sometimes in Kiswahili kifafa. Uh, what I know about it is that uh, when one gets an attack, they fall down and they may come up with a loud uh, cry. And they would want to, some would want to chew the tongue or move around repeatedly. And uh, I think that is the much I know about it. Epilepsy, I think it is a disease that a person falls down. Kifafa in effect, maybe a kili, na mwili ya mutu vile akili yako inawaka. Uh, it can be caused by disease. Traditionally, people would relate it to uh, having someone having been attacked by evil spirits. Inaweza kwa mtu amerogo acha tuseme. Kifafa ni kama mtu anguke kutoka juu hadi chini alafu akili iguzwe kidogo. They should not be put in special institutions. They need to be integrated with the, the other children so that in case they get the seizures, then they have someone to assist them or to help them or someone to call out to the teacher. No, they should come to mainstream. They should be in the mainstream, not in a special school. Because they are no more, it's only that it's a small condition, then uh, of it we are encouraging uh, integration. Uh, kama mejuu maulimi, meno yake meshikana, anafaya kwe kijiko kwa mdomo, ndivu wa siweze kujiumiza, alafu ya kwe malikuna free space, malipana fresh air. One of, the, one of the hindrances we have is knowledge or uh, information. Most parents are inferior of what they are supposed to do. They think the children, because of the society, has um, discriminated on these children that could be their children who are possessed by spirits. So you find that most parents with such children, they fear leaving these children to go out to schools to be with the other children. I think teachers should also be sensitized on uh, how to carry out first aid. I'm advising my fellow children if don't discriminate someone who has that disease because you don't know when you grow up you will give birth to to a child who has it. It's not a witchcraft or something like that. is a disease of the brain and all of our actions everything that we do originates from the brain it is the brain that tells me i can see and what to see to hear to talk when there is a disorder in a particular area of the brain it will be seen as an abnormal physical reaction in the related part of the brain this is of the brain that's number one number two it is not even contagious Sindio. number three that aspect of when that seizure captures that child or a big person, we don't run away. But we have heard that if you can consistently take those drugs, you can have full potential of your life. You can be as productive as everybody else. That's why we are here now. The main, we have to pass this message to our children, to our community, community health workers, all the teachers, 
they have to pass this health education on a pledge to the children. These children will pass up to their families. Generally, a person with epilepsy can completely live their life to, to full potential and with responsibilities in their in their society. That is if we give them a chance. And the people who will give these children a chance are the, the teachers.